All right. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. Okay, ji, sabse pehle welcome to our weekly meeting. Glad we still have a lot of people today as well. Uh, okay, so uh, today's agenda is mostly about syncing up with other teams, seeing okay, all over the other teams like mobile team, backend team, front end team, or rules team, make kya kya activities going on throughout the week. So everybody know, is on the same page and uh, what are the challenges that uh, we could be facing or we are facing, things like that. And besides that, we'll also go today uh, over the uh, the user story, which is uh, the issuer holder and verifier story. It means actors key story, how they will enact in our uh, system. So we'll go through that. Uh, one important thing uh, is, if you have any questions, please go ahead and interrupt me while I'm speaking so that uh, you can just simply say whatever you want. Uh, please uh, go at the end of this uh, uh, document and put your name and email just for everybody else to know who is here, who isn't. So it's good to have keep track of these meetings. So you can find the link in the email. If it's inaccessible or not working, please let me know. Okay. So while you guys are doing that, um, I can give you uh, like a quick highlight of uh, what has happened all over the week. Now, each team has been, first of all, you will be really glad to know, okay, her team, they are working really hard and everybody is uh, putting a lot of effort in making this thing possible. So every person's contribution is appreciated, of course, and at the same time uh, valued. Now, uh, of course, we have some setbacks because kuch log, uh, uh, from the technical point of view, are not so strong. And of course, we also have a lot of technic strongly technical people as well. But they, uh, we all have commitments, and uh, this being an open source, uh, voluntarily initiative, it, it, it requires more of a commitment mindset than uh, like you know what you do for your jobs okay um so without any further delays let's just jump in uh because if you feel like you can always uh, add on to whatever i say in the front end please feel free to do that sure so uh what we did over the last week is hum logo ne ek team finalize kiya jo ke jiski zarurat hai front end ka demo banane ke liye so for, for, firstly we are focusing on the issuer's demo the the organ institution that is going to issue the credential so this is the theme that we finalized it looks something like this uh, it I'm will be more i'm going to show some short demo oh. as well don't worry about okay. that okay okay so uh, once i uh, walk everybody through so maybe you can show them what what you have okay sure okay so uh yeah so hum logo ne team purchase kiya and it was uh, uh, communicated and delivered to the team and they started working on it uh, kuch tasks defined hue uh, over the uh, over the project section in our uh, github uh, so that's also progressing a lot of people in the uh, in the front end team are enthusiastic and working on it uh, there is one small thing. I will jump right to Vakas after this and ask him to show us what we have in the front end team and how we are going to proceed. And uh, the overall user story is that when we reach the rules team, we will discuss it then. And uh, one just choti si announcement uh, Vakas uh, will be unavailable in the last Ashra of Ramadan due to personal reasons. So, uh, so the front end team has to manage things on their own. Of course, I'm here to facilitate uh, the team at any time, but uh, I believe uh, uh, is Saeed with uh, uh, us on the call right now. Uh, I'm not sure if he was able to join us today, but I guess I can talk to Saeed about uh, that. Maybe he can uh, also be a bit engaging in the Akhriya Shrine and 
perhaps we can move things forward. Like I know it's Ramzan, things are moving a bit slow, but inshallah, I believe after Eid, we will have a better pace of things. So Vakas, over to you. I'm going to stop sharing my screen so you can share it now. Okay. Sure, man. Thank you. So my unavailability will be just the last Ashara. So next meeting. And then not an issue. I don't think, I think you guys can take care of this. It's not a big deal. Okay. So can you guys see my screen? Yes, I can. All right. So we have taken, okay. We went through so many hospitals and we find out the, the color of each hospital or the theme is usually red. We are going to use the same, same for issuers. So red, red theme will be there. My plan is to show the logo and then show some small logo that it is related to COVID, just like we have for Trustnet as well. Mm -hmm. So, so what I have done is just, uh, I need the rules team help in this for uh, finalizing the content. What, what should we show? So uh, what I was thinking is to show something like how, okay, what is immunity passport, how uh, it works, what are the benefits and all that on this page. But we have so many, we have design part covered. I mean, it is there in the theme. We just need the content for that. But the real part is, uh, so if we, if I click on issue immunity, uh, we discussed me and uh, uh, Omar that there should be some sort of login mechanism. Uh, we will finalize on how it should be done. But like each, each hospital should have, should have some login credentials and not, it should not be public, right? Not everyone can uh, issue the QR code and uh, do do all the journey. So, for example, we have a we test test, or maybe let's say whatever the doctor name is, Imtiaz. I'm just saying. Password is some very complex password, <laughs> <laughs> and they they say login. Now, now they can enter the f uh, information here of the patient. So maybe mm -hmm. like four four nine zero one. This is dummy, by the way. It's not mine. Okay, don't try it. <laughs> <laughs> Five and vaccination barcode. If they have it, they can scan it. If they have the scanner, or otherwise. So we need to find out what information actually need to be encoded in the blockchain for the certificate. But okay, let's say this is the barcode. Uh, and then they say connect and the QR code is generated. So, so far I have reached here, but then uh, if you guys have seen the Faber College uh, demo, that's what we are mimicking. And same will go with the verifier as well. So right now it's just HTML theme, uh, the same theme I have modified, but then we'll convert it into a React application. Plus uh, we need APIs so that we can actually connect all this dummies to the real real data and we need to decide on what to show on the public side or maybe if it is logged in should we show how many have you issued how many certificates have you issued like being our and can they can the issuer also verify as well so they need the same theme for the verifier as well that also need to be need to be finalized yeah any input so i'll just uh, yeah. Uh, a question is a small barcode basically. Jo 2098. Yeah. Ye yeah. Kya information hai, by the way? Okay, so we were thinking that we blockchain mein jo hum data in the user ki information. Kuch honi Secondly, for example, WHO agar vaccines issue karta hai, to har Okay, this ek... vaccine ki identification, hai, right? Yeah. Okay. So, ye... So you take a track or okay? maybe or, or other information. We don't know yet. Uh, so right you now, have... the schema, we haven't figured out the schema with the rules team yet. I meeting maybe I proceed karunga, so I'll talk about that, that we need to actually figure out the schema for this. And that will define isme, uh, what isme, kind of credential will be issued. If we add one thing, if we add one thing, ID card is fine. But if we add a thumb impression, actually, that is more, more important. So, it will happen that double authentication will become a thumb impression. That is uh, basically 
आईडी कार्ड और थम इम्प्रेशन वो नादरा के साथ मिल रहा होगा समथिंग लाइक दैट राइट अहमद भाई और फिर अहमद भाई द द द यूजर स्टोरी गोस इन अ डिफरेंट वे हम उसको और कॉम्प्लिकेटेड नहीं कर सकते आई आई विल शो यू गाइस द यूजर स्टोरी आफ्टर दिस आई मीन इन अ व्हाइल के एग्जैक्टली हाउ द होल स्टोरी लाइन गोस फॉर द होल्डर ऑफ द वैक्सीनेशन या सो मीन इन द मीन टाइम व्हाट डू यू थिंक अबाउट द थीम फॉर इशू इशूअर it looks amazing bro that's my opinion i think it's pretty good we are moving really good and uh, good work actually vikas and rest of the team as well yeah so uh, any other guys i mean so from rules team who can help us uh, deciding the content and like editing this stuff and like all those screens okay we can finalize that's not a problem but for content mm-hmm. from contents perspective for example i was thinking about this area right footer this could be something like uh try dot connect me oh, sorry i'm typing too fast probably all right so for example here here they show this right connect uh, mm. created by our name so here yeah. here it could be trustnet and then okay powered by sovereign or whatever hyperledger indi or not we are part of cci as well so all this information should be displayed in the footer I agreed. I agree with that. They can just take ledger. Ki baat hai. I'm not sure if we will use sovereign right now. I uh, I had a like a message exchange with Omar from the backend team, and I sent him a message to connect with the BC Gov's the British Columbian government's uh, test ledger. So that's something that's actually the green light one network. So so maybe we would use that for testing purposes. And I'm I'm still like in in. we still need to figure out what kind of network we will be using and of course and that's what going to be there and, but of course for starters we can put something jo hum uh, abhi use kar rahe and then we proceed from there on any any comments anybody or shall we move forward i guess we're good okay uh, i am um, rahim speaking i can help the uh, cast with the content team so that the teams with content writing and designing also so what i can do i can discuss with the cast and i can help i think umair aapki awaaz thodi clear nahi aa rahi can you <clears throat> um uh, did did vikas did you understood what he said Yeah, actually, I was anticipating this. I wanted to say this, but but I didn't take the name. If they are willing to volunteer, they can do whatever they want to do. But okay. I was anticipating this. <laughs> I am glad so, there is this kind of uh, synchronization in the team. <laughs> okay. Uh, glad. Okay. So Umar, you just said that you're going to be volunteering about providing the content for uh, the 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 issuer, right? Yeah. Yeah. perfect perfect we'll we'll get in sync with that in the next week and inshallah inshallah we'll move forward uh okay thank you vakas uh, uh, really great work okay um mobile team has been processing i mean proceeding really fast and really rapidly uh, i am i'm thinking like uh, uh yeah the can i oh, damn i forgot the name but never mind uh I can show you guys what we have so far, but things are um, things are very organized with the mobile team, and the team is actually very uh, active with building things. So I'm gonna just take you into the mobile team's uh, Kanban board, and if you can see, they have a sprint model running right now, and they are a lot of tasks in progress right now, and. Uh, उसमें से काफी ज्यादा काम कुछ काम नॉट काफी ज्यादा बट कुछ काम हो भी चुका है ऑलरेडी अलॉट ऑफ कोड हैज बीन पुश्ड इनटू द रिपोजिटरी एंड मर्ज्ड देयर हैज बीन सम डेवलपमेंट रिगार्डिंग डिजाइन्स एंड लाइक यूआई सो आई एम नॉट श्योर इफ इट्स द बेस्ट नेम फॉर द एप वैक्सन वैक्सन वॉलेट uh but if you have any better suggestions feel free because the I cci was, is yeah i was thinking of immune cred if we can use that i am okay, immune I'll, i am immune immune also was some something that came okay. in my head okay i am i am immune 
I am immune and immune has all those words. Like yeah, I, yeah, I yeah. thought, of, you know, impossible yeah. is I am possible kind of thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I feel you. Okay. So uh, one possible uh, option is uh, app names. So is immune wallet. Okay. Because the CCI actually asked me for, uh, look at this. So this is the CCI's document for sister projects. Uh, and I believe we are here right somewhere in, uh, yeah, here we are. Vaccination certificates. So we need to give them uh, uh, a description of our project. And I kind of don't have a name right now for the project. So um, we need a name for the project, guys. So it needs some brainstorming. Uh, we have one name. We have uh, Vaxen, which is super fancy, but I kind of am not so sure about this. Uh, immune cred. Cred also. Uh, yeah. yeah. Could be immune cred. cred. Yeah. So, but this is something we can discuss later on on the Slack as well and come up with a name and then I can put it here in there, uh, uh, suggest in this document for CCI and also change the UI designs, uh, generate some new logos and, you know, work with that. Uh, so that's something that needs uh, work. Where are we? Yeah. So, so having said that, our uh, have iOS or Android ki ek, uh, uh, application hai jiske kuch had tak uh, wireframes hum logo ne figure out kar li hai aur ye kaam basically in progress hai is waqt aur jitne bhi assets required hai for example wo hum different apps se motivations lekar us pe kaam kare jo bhi different wallet applications hai is waqt out in the market and uh, uh, different kind of assets that are required for example you know onboarding process ke liye kuch uh, assets required hai so that kind of stuff, all of that has been provided to the uh, mobile team in order to move s swiftly. So inshallah, I'm pretty sure that we will be seeing some sort of uh, like uh, really, you know, like clean, like like simple demo, simplish demo very soon from them as well. Hopefully in next uh, week, but their, their sprint is currently ongoing. So inshallah, when the sprint is over, we will have something to uh, in, from the mobile team to also show up. Uh, okay, having said that, I think that's everything that I wanted to cover about the mobile team. Is there anybody right now in the call from the mobile team? Uh, I don't, Zainab is there, I believe. Yes. Yes, yes. Zainab, do you wanna say something about it? I believe you are handling the onboarding part of uh, the, uh, uh, of the yes. app. G actually um, onboarding wala part mein kar rahe hain aur i guess settings uh, wali screen uh, mobin kar rahe hain aur okay said okay. over all sab ko dekh rahe hain theek hai aur said was actually also managing the main layout of the application how it's going to go through but i i still yeah. need to have a discussion with said about the whole flow uh, okay i think i think uh, we can we can move forward uh, okay so rules team has been very, it have, we have had really interesting talks with the Suhail Bhai and uh, uh, Zan and, and uh, Sami over the week on uh, how uh, these uh, roles should be defined. Uh, so what we have right now is a sort of a user story which tells about how the issuer and verifier and a holder would work in this setting. So I will walk you through that, all of you. Um, it's based on a research paper that was published. Uh, um, I can also give you the link for that if you wanna read that research. Uh, it's it's a modified version of that. Uh, this particular uh, like image that I'm gonna show you is a modified version of that research, uh, research image. Uh, all right, uh, but before we move there, I wanted to see if there's something that I wanna talk about yes uh, use case targeting so so Bai suggested that uh, uh, we have uh, of currently in my understanding we were focusing on the vaccination use case which particularly talks about k uh, pakistan may vaccination records and manage vaccination record management ka us process nahi hai or especially proving that you have been vaccinated is actually even one one of the biggest problems in pakistan and this kind of solution can not only help us deal with the COVID-19 vaccination process, uh, but also generally help the citizens of Pakistan that they vaccination 
रिकॉर्ड्स को मैनेज कर सकें आई नो देर इज अस्टम इन प्लेस दैट से ओके स्मार्टफोन पेनिट्रेशन पाकिस्तान में एक हद तक है सो देर लॉट ऑफ पीपल हुई फिफ्टी फाइव मिली लाइक आउट ऑफ टू हंड्रेड टू हंड्रेड प्लस मिलियन पीपल इन पाकिस्तान मोर देन फिफ्टी फाइव मिलियन पीपल ऑलरेडी हैव स्मार्ट फोन एंड हैव एक्सेस टू इंटरनेट ऑन देर फोन सो meaning there there is a lot of potential in this case already and of course moving forward we can also target uh, cases which are uh, wallets which are offline uh, not over the internet or not over the smartphones but we need to start somewhere so but um, with rules team we're still figuring out that uh, of course the primary uh, case we're focusing on is vaccination but there's another case called uh, immunization via uh getting infected so that's also a possibility so hail bhai do you have to do you want to say any words on that or or should i just continue uh please continue because right now it's all in a flux we we're, we're still figuring all of this out so. yes yes so we'll have inshallah more discussions and maybe have some calls next week about this and come to a conclusion about okay, what kind of um, like uh, what's the best way forward like there are so many decisions we have to take in order to do this right um but uh, and and we need to also make sure that we don't go over the scope because they can hum cheez ko bahut bada kar sakte hain but we need to deliver something which is robust good and uh, doesn't create like ke kaam bhatta hi ja raha hai hamare liye okay if it it lies within the scope definitely uh, and if it's important uh, based on what we research, all of us from the rules team will research so we we can include it i don't have any uh, personal things against uh, immunization uh, credentials okay so one of the few things that are important we need to figure out i don't know maybe next week or in the coming weeks is the data attributes in pakistan for vaccination so which means pakistan mein jab kisi ko vaccination lagti hai to kis kisam ka data collect kiya jata hai us bande ke bare mein wo hame uh, kisi tarah figure out karna hai so that's something we need to um, discuss within the uh, rules team to ke koi hum mein se koi ek banda we need to find contacts or resources uh, to do that uh there is one more thing that i just remembered uh it's about uh, covid 19 uh actually yeah covid 19 test results agar kisi ke paas uh, covid 19 ka kisi ne test karwaya ho aur uske paas uski copy ho jo uska result aaya test it would be nice to get our hands on that result to see what kind of data is projected on that report so in fact uh, from different hospitals if it is there then we can compare what what details yes they are commonly printing so that yes. we can use that information yeah Plus, it would be if, nice to yeah yeah if we if we also know when they go inside what happens i mean what is their yeah. uh, 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 yes i want to say something yes sir yes, 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 ji ji bole jaise aapne vaccine ke data ki baat ki agar polio ji polio ki vaccine polio ke bhi cases pakistan mein aate hain aur polio bhi हमारा टॉप के ऊपर है कि उसको किस तरीके से एलिमिनेट किया जा सके लेकिन पाकिस्तान से नहीं हो सका है तो पोलियो की वैक्सीन लेने जब घर घर जाती हैं पोलियो वर्कर तो उसके अंदर वो क्या करते हैं बस उनका जो उनकी एविडेंस होता है वो ये होता है कि बाहर गेट के पास दीवार के ऊपर टॉप से लिख के कर जाते हैं ताकि अगली मरतबा जब वो आए तो देखें कि घर से बच्चों की वैक्सीन हो गई है बाकी जो वो डेटा कलेक्ट करते हैं उनके पास एक शीट होती है जिसके ऊपर वो लिखते हैं कि वैक्सीन हो गई है लेकिन बंदे ने लगवाई है बंदे के पास कोई प्रूफ नहीं आता कि उसने लगवा दी है या नहीं लगवा दी है उसको कोई कार्ड इश्यू नहीं होता उसको कुछ भी कोई पता नहीं लगता कि उसने वैक्सीन लगवाई है या नहीं लगवाई है अगर okay. आप हॉस्पिटल भी जाते हैं जब मैं आप खान गया था अभी कुछ दिन पहले तो वहाँ पे फार्मेसी के साथ ही जो है ना वैक्सीन का काउंटर उन्होंने बनाया था एक रूम में तो वो जो है वो खबरें अपने बच्चों को लेके जा रही थी वैक्सीन वगैरह करवाने के लिए लेकिन आई डोंट थिंक सो कि जो वैक्सीन जिसको हो ये पेशेंट को उसको कोई सर्टिफिकेट या कोई ऐसी चीज मिलती है मेरी नींद की है उसको भी वैक्सीन हो सकती है आई डोंट नो के ये बाकी इफ आई रिमेंबर इट राइट वेन आई वॉज मूविंग टू फिनलैंड आई हैड टू गेट अ पोलियो वैक्सीनेशन इवन दो आई वॉज ऑफकोर्स वैक्सीनेशन हैज अट न्योर दैट इट स्टे इन योर सिस्टम एंड आफ्टर दैट यू हैव टू बी गेट री वैक्सीनेटेड आफ्टर टेन ईयर्स ऑफ फाइव ईयर अभी मैंने अपने बेटे की इज अ न्यू बॉर्न उसकी वैक्सीनेशन करवाई है तो यहाँ यू में ही होता है कि एक कार्ड होता है जो गवर्नमेंट का कार्ड गवर्नमेंट आपको एक कार्ड इशू करती है जिसके अंदर सारे वैक्सीनेशन के स्केजल देखे होते हैं फिर अच्छा दो महीने बाद ये वाली लगेगी और फिर उसके आगे डॉक्टर का सिग्नेचर है वो सब होता है फिर ये कार्ड है जो हम फिर स्कूल में सबमिट करवाते हैं 
उनके पास हो गई है उनके पास देखिए चाइल्ड चिल्ड्रन पेड्रियाटिक कंसेंट पे जहां तक बात आती है वो तो उधर से दैट्स अनदर स्टोरी आई डोंट वांट टू गो देयर राइट नाउ आई एम आई एम डूइंग द प्रोजेक्ट चक्कर ये है सॉरी चक्कर ये है एज अ पेरेंट ये यानी कि पाकिस्तान में आपको डाटा uh, दिया जाता है ठीक है अब uh, मेरे भाई डॉक्टर हैं ठीक है जी तो ये गवर्नमेंट भी जो जो लगा रही होती है वो आपको डाटा देती है यानी कि वो आपको एक कार्ड इशू करती है कि जी आपको ये 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 वैक्सीनेशन लग चुकी हुई है ये पाकिस्तान की बात कर रहा हूँ मैं ठीक है ना तो और जो प्राइवेट करवा रहे हो तो उनको तो वो मिल ही रहा होता जैसे अभी वो भाई ने कहा कि जी दुबई में करवाई और वो तो ये हमें भी यहाँ पे स्कूल में जमा करवाना पड़ता है जो कि जी कितनी इसको वो हो गई है पहले ये पॉलिसी नहीं होती थी लेकिन अब ये पॉलिसी है मेरे बच्चों ने जाना शुरू किया तो मुझे वो डॉक्यूमेंट देना पड़ा उनको ठीक है ओके सो वट वी नीड इज वी नीड वॉल्टियर्स फ्रॉम रूल्स टीम जो कि इस पर्टिकुलर टास्क पे काम करेंगे जो फिगर आउट करेंगे व्हाट काइंड ऑफ मैंने अभी पूछा है एक एक दो दोस्त हैं इस्लाम बाद में उनका टेस्ट उन्होंने करवाया था उनका नेगेटिव आया था जब okay. पाकिस्तान में नेगेटिव टेस्ट आता है तो आपको रिपोर्ट इशू नहीं कर रही है आपको सिर्फ जो एनआईसी है ना नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन ऑफ हेल्थ वो सिर्फ आपको कॉल करके बता देता है कि आपका जो है ना टेस्ट वो नेगेटिव आया है तो उसमें आपको कोई रिपोर्ट इशू नहीं होती जस्ट हां जस्ट इन केस अगर आपका पॉजिटिव आता है तो आपको रिपोर्ट इशू होती है तब आप जब एडमिट करते हैं तब आपको एक रिपोर्ट इशू कर रहे हैं ये मैं बता रहा हूं आपको इस तरह बात का ओके व्हाट डोंट यू हैव द राइट टू योर ओन डाटा लाइक दे टुक योर ब्लड फॉर गॉड सेक नहीं यहां पे रिपोर्ट नहीं दे रहे तो ये आपको की नहीं दे रहे रिपोर्ट्स रिपोर्ट्स इधर नहीं दे रहे मेरा एक क्लास फेलो है वो शायद काम कर रहा है वहां शोकत खानम तो मैं उसे ट्राई okay. करती हूं कि वो अगर रिपोर्ट uh, का डाटा दे दे ओके सो ऑल ऑफ यू गाइस इन योर नेटवर्क्स प्लीज लुक आउट फॉर वैक्सीनेशन एंड कोविड-19 रिलेटेड डाटा सो टू थिंग्स दैट वी नीड वन इज कोविड-19 के जो टेस्ट हो रहे हैं उसके उसकी जो रिपोर्ट्स आती हैं कि उसके अंदर क्या डाटा यूज होता है फॉर एग्जांपल योर नेम योर सीएनआईसी योर आई डोंट नो योर सम लेवल्स ऑफ सम केमिकल्स और व्हाटएवर to figure out okay do you have it or you don't have it so that kind of stuff and the, on the other other side we need people uh, especially dedicated in rules team jo ke na uh, vaccination ke bare mein jo jab jo data collect hota na us particular data pe research karenge for example what kind of information is uh, needed there uh, uske liye i'm not sure if somebody wants to volunteer right now please go ahead agar nahi abhi then maybe you can talk and maybe assign some tasks this to somebody who who can do it uh because kafi log abhi is meeting mein nahi bhi hain so there is a like there is a possibility that we can always find somebody to get to do this okay um now can i say something sorry uh, ji so well see uh main bas ye add karunga ke sara focus jo vaccination ya test ya us pe nahi hona chahiye what we need to know is see hamara jo goal hai wo certificate issue karna hai na ji ji that somebody is immune what matters to us is ke jin logo ne us certificate ko istemal karna hai yani verifiers jo hai hmm wo kya information chahte hain so agar you know for example wo bahut bada use case aur aapne bhi document mein dala hai airlines hai na hmm to agar ho koi कनेक्शन किसी एयरलाइंस के साथ तो पता लगे कि वो क्या चाहेंगे देखना इससे पहले कि वो एक होल्डर को बोर्ड करने दें फ्लाइट सोहेल भाई व्हाट डू यू थिंक अबाउट कि देखें इशू वेरीफायर तो वही इंफॉर्मेशन वेरीफाई कर सकता है जो इशुअर ने इशू की है सो इट्स लाइक अ चिकन एग प्रॉब्लम 
Maybe, so, maybe uh, I understand what you're saying, but what I'm yeah. saying is the whole purpose of the certificate hmm. is that it can be used. Yeah, yeah. If the PIA has asked for the board to ask for the certificate, then our focus is that what they want to do. Okay, okay. okay. You, you understand my point? Yes. How do you think the vaccination is? Okay, these are okay. But... I think our point of view is, uh, you know, what is important for us is that our certificate actually is used. Can be verified. So, so hmm. we, yeah. What do you say? Yes, I mean, I'm, I'm done. I'm just, I'm just pointing that the verifiers, hai, we need to know what are they going to need. And my opinion is, CCI is doing a lot of work on this and they are going mm. to create a, a certificate, you know, the, the, the schema and the schema the, for that. The, yes, 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 yes. But I need to put our input there as well. Oh, sorry, Umar, you are talking about it. Okay, uh, what I wanted to say that ke, once we know this kind of information on our side, we can CCI in input kar sakte hai, ke, this is what we have in Pakistan. And that's, that will affect the way they create the schema to actually adjust to our needs as well. So that's my point. Yeah, mm -hmm. and my point is, my point is, if they want to know what do we need, what they are going to be focusing on is what verifiers in Pakistan need to be able to value and trust the certificate. You see? Anyway, I'm done. Thank you. Okay. Umar, you were saying something else. Yes, I wanted to say that. For example, we have a point that issuer and verifier have to bridge the two of them. We have to make an application to use the verifier, but the issuer will do the issuer. So, in this case, as Sail Bhai has also talked about, we have to consider the issuer and the verifier to consider what to do with the issuer and the verifier. But, as you have talked about, we will do the issuer and the verifier, which will be issued. So, we have to make an application to the issuer and the verifier. तो यहाँ पे हमें कोई एप्लीकेशन बनाए हम तो वही चीज बनाएंगे जो कि हम ब्रिज का काम करेगा इश्यू इश्यूर और वेरीफायर के दरमियान में तो मेरे ख्याल में हमें उनको भी ऑन बोर्ड लेना पड़ेगा इश्यूर और वेरीफायर को कि वो कौन सी इनफॉरमेशन देंगे या वो कौन सी इनफॉरमेशन वेरीफायर करना चाहेंगे Okay, so this actually definitely requires some work and a meeting probably of its own to discuss के how we're gonna take this forward and of course it also yes वकास yeah so Actually, you are saying that you have to discuss the rules in the meeting because if you talk about the airline, they might need a passport. But if you have to verify the internal Pakistan, then there might be an IC. An IC will be enough. Now, the passport will not be all of them, right? An IC will be all of them. An IC will be all of them, so you can verify it from there as well. The passport is a super set of an IC in this case, right? Yeah. Yes, yes. But it's true that when we show the issuer and verifier, maybe that's when we will figure out or maybe if we can figure out before that, that's much better. Okay. All right. So let's have a discussion over the next week on these topics that we just touched briefly today. Okay. One more thing is Local Web of Trust, the CCI's use case 00. So he'll buy mentioned this that we need to define the accreditors uh role in this so i'm, I'm not going to deep go deep into this because i'm a rules team key discussion so we'll, we'll, it's more about okay, who is going how are you going to verify the verifiers so definitely we're going to look into that as well because it's important uh how our systems will be able to manage that kind of trust it's more about translating the real world's trust into the digital world and making sure that it sustains so yeah so inshallah in the next week we're gonna uh, we're gonna look into these things uh, what we just briefly discussed and uh, move forward uh moving forward to the last section is the back end team uh i have personally had some challenges uh because uh, i have been distributed all over the place with all the other teams so with back end team i have not been able to put enough time uh but uh, i have had a meeting with uh, uh shakib in the last week and we discussed how we want to take through things. So there are some tasks uh, for the backend team in the uh, in their uh, in their Kanban board uh, that needs to be done. So the sprint is empty right now, which means kinda they have the, 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 there's there isn't any work started yet. So that's something that 
sounds a bit alarming for me in a way that uh, it's like um, uh, there's a possibility we might hit a wall in a way that uh, mobile team or front end team might need something from the back end team but back end team ne kabhi kuch taiyar nahi kiya so because there is certain learning curve with the some technologies uh, in the back uh, but inshallah i'm pretty sure i just received a message from amar he's moving really fast with things and shakib is also doing pretty well and uh, we have a very small back end team and uh, i think uh, we need to change our strategy a little bit in the back end team to to move things a bit more on on a bit more faster pace so, but inshallah i'm hoping that next week would be better uh, in terms of uh, getting some thing to show you guys hopefully uh, because it's more like an agile uh, approach you know we we build something we fail about fail with the the concept we we rebuild it with the better concepts so uh, shakib i believe you're on the call do you want to add something to what i just said nahi aapne sahi bataya mai ye bolna chahunga ki ha abhi tak kaam start nahi hua lekin next week mein sprint plan karke hum log inshallah kaam start kar denge back end pe learning curve aaya tha to humne is week mein usko cope up kar liya aur ha hum kaam start kar denge next week se so probably next week ke end mein kuch na kuch task complete honge aur sprint pura plan hua hua hoga perfect perfect inshallah i'm hoping things will be all good okay i think i have taken around 42 minutes so far does anybody have any questions or should i just move to the uh, the whole uh, user like issuer holder verifier story flow and maybe walk you through this and then we all are good to uh, we can end this meeting um or is there any questions anybody has about what we just discussed or talked about oh yeah if you are in the meeting uh, there is a comment uh, i still see there a lot of people who haven't put their names here so a uh, link maine chart mein dala hua which you can actually i can put it again there you can come in this document and uh, put your name and email there so we know that you have attended usually jo log meeting attend karte hain wo thoda matlab ke char panch minute late aaye to when i said it that you have to put your name in this document they were they didn't listen to it so jo log late aaye they can they, they can put it there um okay so what i can do is i can walk you through uh, the chronological order workflow that we have right now i'm not saying this is the end of how things are going to happen but uh, this is something what we have right now and uh, we will move from this concept to forward it is based on it is it is based on a research paper published in cornell university about covid-19 antibody test certification there is an app for that um and uh, the research paper talks about how the cci and other people are using a uh, um like verify digital verifiable credentials using blockchains to uh, to issue digital certificates for sars cov2 and uh, these digital certificates that can prove that you have a vaccine you have immunity actually of antibodies so this particular research case uh, research paper is about ki aap ye prove kare ki antibodies hain and you have an app that can prove it on your behalf now uh, one thing that is uh, to be noted this particular uh, what they have implemented is based on ethereum uh, which is completely opposite of what we are doing in terms of um, implementation um, we are working on a public permission blockchain either sovereign or our own trustnets uh, network so this uh, what i have here uh, is bit changed from based on what they have in that research paper so i have used their uh, assets to create this i hope uh, they are fine with that <laughs> okay so so first of all we have an issuer which is in green and then we have a holder which is the end user which has a mobile wallet app is in blue and then a verifier which is in red now issuer and verifier have an portal and like uh, vakash showed in the beginning they have their portals which are uh, secure and locked and they their people need to have uh, their own verification in order to access those portals and whereas when it comes to the end user wo wo play store app store se wo app download kar sakta so first thing that happens is that <clears throat> the holder the jo ban, jo banda hai wo doctor ke paas jata hai और डॉक्टर उसका फिजिकल प्रूफ चेक करता है 
बेसिकली उसका सी ठीक है जब वो उसका सी देखता है उसके बाद वो वैक्सीनेशन को प्रिपेयर करता है स्टेप टू में और स्टेप थ्री में वो उसकी वैक्सीनेशन की इन्फॉर्मेशन को फिल करता है कि फॉर एग्जांपल कि ये वैक्सीनेशन मैं इसको लगाने लगा हूँ और इसका फिजिकल प्रूफ का आई ये है ब्ला 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 और उसके बेस पे क्यू आर कोड स्टेप सिक्स में स्टेप फाइव में वो उसे वैक्सीनेशन लगाता है और उसके बाद उसे क्यू कोड प्रेजेंट करता वो बंदा उस क्यू कोड को स्कैन करता और उसे एक डिजिटल सर्टिफिकेट इशू होता है जो कि उसके फोन में स्टोर होता है इस पूरे वर्कफ्लो में अभी ब्लॉकचेन का इंट्रेक्शन नहीं है बिकॉज इट्स टू शो यू द होल यूजर स्टोरी लाइफ साइकिल इन द लास्ट स्टेप नाउ दिस यूजर इन ब्लू ही हैज अ सर्टिफिकेट इन इज फोन जो कि प्रूव कर सकता है कि उसके पास उसको वैक्सीनेशन लगी हुई है वो लेट से एयरपोर्ट जाता है या किसी जगह पर जाता है जहाँ पर उसे इस प्रूफ को इस इस सर्टिफिकेट को प्रूफ करने की जरूरत पड़ती है तो जो अथॉरिटी वाले लोग हैं वो उससे उसका फिजिकल प्रूफ मांगते हैं वो अपना सीन ऐसी निकाल के देता है उसका सी एन सी चेक होता है और उसकी बेस पर उसे एक क्यू आर कोड प्रेजेंट किया जाता है वेरीफायर की तरफ से और जो बंदा है जो होल्डर है वो उस क्यू आर कोड को जब स्कैन करता है तो वेरीफायर को उसकी उसका प्रूफ मिल जाता है और इन द लास्ट स्टेप वो प्रूफ जो है वो वेरीफाई होता है फ्रॉम द डिसेंट्राइज लेजर सो दिस इज हाउ द होल यूज केस वर्क फ्लो हमने इस पर काफी बार डिस्कशन की है विद विकास एंड सुहेल भाई थिंग्स आर स्टिल इवॉल्विंग चीजें कुछ ऊपर नीचे हो सकती हैं कुछ कॉन्सेप्ट ऊपर नीचे हो सकते हैं बट ओवरऑल दिस सीम्स लाइक इन अ फेस टू फेस इंटरेक्शन दिस इज व्हाट द मॉडल लुक्स लाइक व्हेन वी टॉक अबाउट लाइक ऑनलाइन मॉडल जिसमें आपको बंदे के पास जाना ही ना पड़े फॉर एग्जाम्पल आप घर से बैठ के ही टिकट बुक करें एंड यू नीड टू प्रूफ के हाउ टू वेरीफाई योर वैक्सीनेशन सर्टिफिकेट उसके उस केस पर अभी हमने उस तरह डिस्कशन नहीं किया बट दिस इज समथिंग फेस टू फेस बेस्ड कॉन्सेप्ट एंड इट्स कम्प्लीटली डूएबल ऑल्सो बेस्ड ऑन दिस रिसर्च लाइक आई जस्ट शोड यू सो एनी कॉमेंट्स ऑन दैट और एनी थिंग यू डिट अंडरस्टैंड यू वॉन्ट नो अबाउट लास्ट पर so okay i can i can try to explain it again so step 9 se ye shuru hota so you go to some place where you want to let's say you are traveling okay so you go to airport aap apne boarding counter pe gaye aapne unko apna physical proof nikal ke diya theek hai unhone aapka cnic check kiya aur unhone aapko ek qr code present kiya aapne apna phone nikala apna unka qr code scan kiya they got a proof of that you have वैक्सीनेशन उस प्रूफ के अंदर आपके सीएनएसी की इंफॉर्मेशन दिया नाउ दिस इज वेयर द पर्सन ह्यूमन ट्रस्ट लेयर कम्स इन दैट दे कैन एक्चुअली वेरीफाई के ये जो वेरिफिकेशन जो वैक्सीनेशन प्रूफ है इट एक्चुअली बिलोंग्स टू दिस आईडी जो कि फिजिकल वर्ल्ड में आपके हाथ में ठीक है ओके तो इसका मतलब यही है ना कि हमने जिस तरह एनआईसी और वो रखा है या उसी की उसी की बेस पे उसको उन्होंने क्यू आर कोड दिखाया और फिर वो उसी से मैच कर रहे हैं कि अच्छा इसके सर्टिफिकेट के साथ ये एनआईसी अटैच है हां बेसिकली बेसिकली यहां पर जो क्यू आर कोड जनरेट हो रहा है स्टेप 11 में इट हैज नो डायरेक्ट रिलेशनशिप विद द क्यू आर कोड जो के वेरिफिकेशन ऑफ ट्रस्ट ऑन अ ऑन अ ह्यूमन टू डिजिटल ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन है जो ट्रस्ट की इट हैपेंस बाय दिस पर्सन ह्यूमन बीइंग जो के फिजिकल वर्ल्ड में आईडी को चेक कर रहा है और क्यू आर को और जो उसको डिजिटल प्रूफ वेरीफाई होकर उसके सामने आया उसमें जो इन्फॉर्मेशन है उससे उससे उसे मैच करके देख रहा है देन ही अलाउज यू टू गिव यू अ बोर्डिंग पास और व्हाट एवर टू मूव ओके ओके असल में इस डायग्राम में इन्होंने 9 के बाद 12 फिर 10 11 ये इस तरह ये मैंने किया है सो वी कैन चेंज इट वी कैन चेंज इट वी कैन चेंज इट इट्स लाइक आई सेड इट्स टेंटेटिव एंड आई हैव बीन ओप्स सॉरी अबाउट दैट आई जस्ट गॉट अ मैसेज ऑन स्लैक फ्रॉम समवन ओके ओके अह all right so but uh, uh, things like i said could move a little bit here and there but the idea behind the whole thing is that we are not building something to replace the current identity verification systems what we are building is is to complement current systems jo abhi current kyunki pakistan mein completely digitalized nahi ja sakte so what we need is something that can complement the current digital infra uh, the current paper based infrastructure of credentials so for that i think a hybrid model like this could really work Okay. Uh, having said that, I think that's pretty much it for today's call. If you guys have any questions, I'm open for that. Or uh, anybody has questions for anybody else, 
uh, we can take them or else I guess we can uh, end this meeting.